Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. My name is GBay99. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. Today, we're back with a short, quick League of Legends video where I want to show you guys something. This is something that I thought was common knowledge. I thought most people knew this. I'm sure plenty of you guys already know this, and you could just skip this video if you already do. This is not going to be new information for you. But anyway, uh, this is something that I've noticed a lot of people in my ranked games don't realize. It's something you can get out of, and a lot of people just, uh, apparently, this isn't common knowledge, so I thought I would let you guys know. So, so autofill, you guys all know autofill. Um, autofill is the little button right here you can see next to my queue up button where uh, I just queued up for a normal draft game here and I will not always get my primary and secondary role. You can see before I even queued up, this was here. It's not taking into account uh, what roles I'm queuing for. Um, but if I queue up right now, then I might not get my primary or secondary role. Uh, I might end up getting stuck on support, mainly the role that people play the least, because currently, according to the system, there is a small number of players in this queue at the moment. So uh, we're, we're to alleviate the high queue times, I would have to deal with otherwise, right? it might just shove me on support for me to not have to deal with that. There's actually a way to get out of autofill though. Um, this is not new information. Like I said, a lot of people already know this, but you want to see what it is. All you got to do is cancel the lobby, remake it, and ta-da! Autofill is gone. The way the system works, as is my understanding, is the moment that you queue up for a game, the moment you click this launch button and queue up for a game, that's when the system decides. It will check the player population for every role, and if it says that there aren't enough people playing support, or there aren't enough people playing jungle, or anything like that, then it will say, okay, you're gonna, you, it will give you the autofill button, and then uh, you might have to play one of those roles. Now, if I queue up right now, because the button isn't here, the whole purpose of the button is to let you know you might be queuing into a role that you aren't selecting. So because there is no button here, the system will never give me a role outside of top and mid if I queue up for top and mid. It will never give me a role outside of my two primary roles because that's the purpose of the button, to let you know if you have to not play one of those roles. However, if I cancel and make a lobby again, oh, autofill might come back. That's because the system is checking every time I make a new lobby. That's when it's checking to see if I might need to, uh, if I might be required to do my duty as a League of Legends player and play a not, uh, not not one of my champions. But all you have to do is remake the lobby and you will get rid of the autofill. If we ever have a queue that pops and we choose not to accept it, or maybe we're AFK and we just don't accept it because we're AFK and we aren't here to click ready, then the queue will provide another check right when uh, right as we exit the queue. We will, again, if they need autofill, it will pop back up. But you can just remake the lobby again and get rid of autofill, get one of the two roles you want to play. I know this is something that most people know how to do, and it's something that you don't actually have to deal with that much unless you do get into the higher percentile of ratings. You guys all say that Diamond 5 isn't real Diamond and I suck and everything, but like even in Diamond 5, I think Platinum is, uh, you know, still like upper Platinum is the top 4% of players, Diamond is the top 2%. So it is something you have to deal with a little more the higher rating that you go, but this is just normal, f normal, uh, I almost said normal flex. This is just normal draft mode. This is an another instance where you have to deal with autofill. So if you ever if you ever get autofilled, just remake your lobby and you will be fine. You don't have to worry about playing support and please don't get in my ranked games and say you got autofilled onto a role that you don't actually know how to play. You don't want to ruin everyone's games or make someone dodge. Anyway, just a short video. I know a lot of you guys already know this, but this is just for those of you who don't. I will be back tomorrow with a much more real, legit, actual video, either a gameplay commentary or some sort of discussion video. I will see you all then, but until then, thank you very much for watching. Good luck in solo queue and have a wonderful day.